The first time I realized that God had called me to religious life was the time when I couldn't stop going to Mass. I had to go every day. And the days where I did not go to Mass, I felt that there was this emptiness within my heart. And there was this longing in my heart for something greater than what I was doing and living within my daily life. And somehow I kept thinking of Jesus a lot. And my mother took me to this little nursing home in Janesville, Wisconsin. And there I saw for the first time Sisters with Habits. And it was amazing. I had never seen that before. And they just look like angels. And one of those sisters came to me, a younger sister, and she said to me, um, you know, would you like to come visit us? And maybe, you know, you might want to be a sister. And I thought, I don't think so, sister. Beautiful, you look great, but that's not my life. As days went by, and the year went by actually, I started to go to Mass every day, and I got to a point where I could not stop going. And I started to long for Jesus very much. Eventually, the sister kept asking me, and another one was visiting one weekend, and she said, would you like to go with me over to Baltic in Connecticut? The first thing I thought, I love God, there's no way I'm going to be a sister. I said, well, at least I can go to Connecticut and see it. I've never been there. So I came, and I was here in the mother house for three days. I couldn't believe it. It was just beautiful. All these sisters working, do, praying, doing so many things together. The prayer life was just beautiful. The community life was amazing too. Everything was just like a dream. During those three days, something within me told me that this was going to be my home. But the greatest of all were the moments when I went back home and I was with my mother and I went to the daily mass the day after I arrived from Baltic. And as soon as I received Holy Communion, as I was going back to my pew and I was praying, thanking God for the gift of just being at that mother house, I heard within my heart and in my mind, I saw it go back. And I knew without any moment hesitation that that was God asking me to return. And with great joy in my heart and in my soul, I said, yes, Jesus, I'm going back. And I cried and I cried and I was so happy. And then I came here and everything began to become the bride of God.